Let me first start off by saying huge shout out to Tango Tech. As you can see, the Iron Titan is working and operational behind me. Without his awesome genius, I would not have been able to do this. I'm not the mastermind behind this build. I just know how to follow directions really well. So thank you, Tango Tech, for such an awesome build and your genius behind making the Iron Titan. And for all the other awesome builds that you have, we here on the Riotcraft server, we, we appreciate it so much. So this video is kind of dedicated to him and everything that he's done as a technical professional in Minecraft. So thank you. You rock. You guys check out the rest of the video and how, I, how long it took me to build this sucker. Thanks, Tango. Oh my god. Look at all of them. Can we kill them? Oh my gosh. This is so bad. <laughs> There's so many golems. Oh, I gotta kill all of these now. Welcome, friends, to a new episode of Riot Craft Season 3. Hey, guys, I'm Clobber Stomp. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I know I'm having an awesome day. And if you guys saw the last episode, you guys can see we had an awesome start. What excitement. So, um, the server's been up for about a day, and I am returning to town to take a look at some stuff. We're going to crack on to something else for Episode 2 but we're going to go check that out in a minute. So let's turn around and see what's going on. Oh my gosh. Whoa, we've already got people's builds. We've got a windmill. Oh my gosh, we got farms. I know Shay was working on these. They're looking amazing. This is great. It looks like none of the rabbits can come in and get stuff. We've got, oh, we've got a cow farm, so uh, I can get tons of food. Uh, looks like we've got uh, a pub, so this is our community. Oh, and we've already got a full enchanting setup. Oh, fantastic. We're going to have to partake in some of that. Oh, uh, we've got... <coughs> oh, man! Ender chests. We've got potion brewing. Oh, beautiful, guys. You guys are awesome. First community house, November 16th. Oh, baby. So, it is November 17th, as a matter of fact. And, ooh, darkness... And there's some beds in here, so I'm going to sleep in the middle because I take up lots of room. And then we're going to check out some rest. So, episode two is going to be something completely different. So, we've got, apparently, something's going up over there. I don't know if that is Cribs's, uh town hall or, or not. That might be somebody else's. But we've got a community mine. Look at that. Bam, goes down. Mm-hmm. Like all other mines. Looks like people have already started their spawn base houses. Look at this thing. I am I know I'm probably showing this off, but this is all going to be shut off in someone else's channel before I get to it. Oh, this is McCribs. Wow, dude. Busy beavers, these guys. Wow. Look at that. Did some terraforming. So, I don't know if that's somebody else's houses up there, but I think Cribs is going to be doing a town hall, and it's going to go up there where that pumpkin is so I'm kind of excited to see what goes on with that um, I know there's a lot of other people around but we're gonna go travel to spawn we're at town right now which is about 500 blocks away and I will see you guys at spawn welcome to our glorious spawn we made it we got back so as you can see I have been working very hard we're going to split you up to there and there so because I need some food. So, oh, I kind of gave a little sneak peek. Did you see it? So what we're going to be building here is since we're at the spawn chucks, here is spawn center. Mm-hmm. This is the center of spawn. We, I figured since we had so many issues with um, resources last last season that... The first thing I'm going to do in episode two, that's right, guys, episode two, we're going to start making the Iron Titan. Yep, right away. Thank you, Tango Tech, for your awesome design. We are going to build that today, right now. So I'm going to get started. 
as you guys can see, I've already gathered a majority of the materials that I'm going to need. I know I'm going to need more doors, but as you can see, I got my lovely tree farm over there. Bam, trees. So we've been cutting those down, making doors, planting, cutting. And then over here, we've I've also got a community mine here at spawn. It's right around the corner here. You guys can see it here. Bam, it's down there. It's nothing fancy. It's just straight all the way down. And yeah, so I want to get started right away and have the Iron Titan going before the end of episode two. So I will get some progress going and I will see you guys in a minute. All right, guys, as you can see, we have got the platform done. So what that means is we need to start putting off the roofs to the platform so we can start placing our doors and villages. But sadly... I don't think I have enough glowstone. So, we're going to have to make a nether run and get enough glowstone so we can put them in there. Because I think we need, that's 32, we need 10, 20, 40, and then the roof, which I don't remember is how much. And we also need glass. I have not found any glass, and we only have 27 glowstone. So, I'm going to go gather that stuff up. And I will give you another progress report when we have made it. So, check it out, peeps. We are ready. So, as you can see, we've got the whole platform set up and done. I gathered my glowstone. I gathered a whole lot more bricks, uh, cobblestone. We have got our little containment units for the uh, villagers. So... We are going to go check out what Mr. Cribs has been doing. He has been working on a villager breeding system exactly for this purpose. So let's go check out and see what he's doing, and we will be right back. So Do you want to see where the farm is? Yes, I need villagers, and I, I, I've been told that you and... And dog ha have them for me. Yes, they're over here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna steal them. Alright, they're this way. Ooh. I don't know how you're gonna steal them, but. Oh, don't worry. I, I've got plans. I have You've got plans. your ways. I have my ways. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I have fashioned a minecart railing system transporting setup. It's gonna be a pain in the butt, but I think we'll be good. Ooh. There it is, people. That's what so does we it, need. Yeah. But, and there's more down here. Oh, sweet action. Yeah, because so I'm going to... So if you come down here. Awesome. I think they're over here. Yeah, they're back here. Oh, beautiful. Oh, that's so good. So as uh, you guys know, since you're on... Can they hear me? Your, your stream? I think they can. I'm not sure. Uh... Yes, yeah, can you guys Let me hear. unpause the stream. Wow. Oh beautiful. Oh, they can. They oh. can hear me. Good. Okay. They can hear me. I can hear me. So that means good. Yes, these right. since you guys are all in the stream, you guys get a sneak peek of what I need all these villagers for. The Iron Titan. Yep. Oh look at they're 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 making they're making babies. Did you see it? Are you showing him? <laughs> yeah, club. Show club. Woo! Is that dog? Yeah, he's right behind me. Snoop Doggy Dog? Oh, yeah, that's Snoop Doggy that, Dog. That's the video show machine. He needs to take the ones from, from the top. He says this is, the, I guess, the generator of villagers, and you can take the ones from the top. Gotcha. Perfect. How do you get the ones from down here up there? Do they, See over there in the corner? They, fun, water they funnel their way up through this water yes. elevator. Okay, cool. A, yeah, I see a water elevator over here, right? Yeah. <coughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Sweet. Oh, thanks. This is a huge help to me. Now all I got to do is move them. Great, thanks. I guys. I, 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 did, I obviously did everything. You should, you oh did yeah, you. I'm sure. Yeah. He's just you're the mastermind. I know what's going on. Yeah, yeah, obviously. Did. Oh, <laughs> and peeps, look at what we have. Look at what uh, they did too. So there's a, we have a skeleton spawner here, right? And, and a zombie. Skeleton, yeah, skeleton and zombie. All the levels, peeps. Look at this. Bam. Just get all the levels, like right here. Look at. These guys are so smart. So I'm missing two kids. Skeletons one. Mm -hmm. Oh, we probably shouldn't even be. Let's hit him with a bow. One hit kills, right? 
Bam. Yeah, he said he said skeletons are one hit, zombies are two. And that does is that affected by the sword? So sword will be one for everything? No, no. Yeah, yeah. Just with the hand. Oh, if you just with the hand. I put um, it the have more on stop, you know, <laughs> Just punching with the infinity bow. Yeah, I just punched him with my infinity bow. That works. Uh, but now I have a bone, so I can bone them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yes, I do. Oh, this is yes, perfect, do, guys. This is exactly what I needed. So this is such a huge help. I am absolutely 100% grateful. This is going to benefit the server so much. Like, a lot. Like, all of these villagers, all you buddies, all you buddies are going to have a new home. You can better get Shakira ready. is offended. Shakira thinks you're going to taint the landscape with your railway. I'm not gonna taint anything. You guys won't even know it's here. It's gonna be. It's gonna happen so fast. It's gonna be up and down. You guys won't even see it. It's gonna be amazing. All right, guys, we are back and check it out. I have made some progress. Well, one, we got villagers up there. You can't see them because they're not rendered in, but they're there. I'll show you in a minute. We also got uh, this a wonderful contraption going. <laughs> Let's check it out. I'll show you what it does. So we've got the killing chamber up here look at that they fall down from there and then they fall to the hoppers and they die to their death mm -hmm. which is pretty cool so and then all of the iron goes through here now there's poppies in this one so any poppy overflow <coughs> excuse me goes to this and then gets output through these hoppers here which go to this dispenser which shoot them into the portal now this is just a mechanism, There's this is a comparator, uh, just a little timer, so anytime something comes up here, which it is feeding all of these down into the hopper to kick this out. So the redstone clock runs right here, Ooh, can't really see it, kicking this back and forth, there's a timer here, which is about 30-ish uh, seconds, maybe not even. Um, that kicks this back and forth. If we wait here for a second, we will see this go through here. And as you can see, we've got another full house. Look at that. Everybody's on. Uh, we're with the exception of Solo and Avamance, it looks like. But wow, we are rolling. So this is rolling. We are ready. So now we will go up front, up top, and I'll show you what we've been doing. It's now time for everybody's favorite, favorite placing of the doors it is so difficult but i'm going to show you guys how much progress we made and you guys can really get <coughs> excuse me oh a little tickle in my throat excited so check it out we've got villagers up there bam we got villagers up there bam and as you can see i've been busy yeah i didn't want to bore you guys with putting all the uh the doors in but we'll go through one of these together so each one of these is a village. Right now there's 30 of them. So each section here is a village. All of these villages are stacked next to one another. And this has a village that's right about here. So it, it the village decides to spread itself out based on the position of the doors. So this village is right about here. Now the reason we're doing that is because we're going to take this village and we're going to make a new one. Now the way we do that is we're going to go out here and the first village that it's gonna pick up is these villagers because they're closest to the door that you place so if I place this door here BAM we got a brand new village so now we need to take this village and we need to move it down there and the best way to do this is to then start coming over here and go boom oh someone went through a sleep cycle oh yeah so now the village is about halfway between here and there and you should wait about six seconds before you decide to place a door because what can happen is if you do it too fast you will lose the door so now what we're going to do is we've waited about six seconds we're going to break this door bam now this village moved that door down there and we're, I use this as a marker to just remember where I'm at. As you can see, I started way down there, and we went all the way down here. I've done the same process 30 times. This is number 31. So now we're going to move it a little bit more. So we're going to line this up. 
boom I've got these markers here on each one of the things boom so now we have moved the village to right about somewhere in between the two of these doors now if you want a really good explanation of this you need to check out Tango Tech's uh, explanation and tutorial on how to build this it's all in the description you can check them out now I think that this design breaks in 1.9 however we're not on 1.9 we're still on 1.8 so we're gonna get this thing rolling as quickly as we can that's why we're doing it in episode 2 so we can get as much iron as we can before it breaks and we have to fix it so that is going oh let's make that let's get rid of that guy I wanna make sure we keep in our place now I've only got one left so I mean it's not hard to remember where we're at but yep so we're going up and down this whole thing so that's been about six seconds. We can break this. The village is right about here. We'll break it. And the village moves to this door. Now what we're doing is we're easing this village all the way back to here so we get them all in a line. Which is great. That's what we need to do. So we'll wait our six seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six. And usually I count to about ten just to make sure. Because if you do it too fast you might screw it up. So it's good to be patient with this. It is very time consuming. This has taken a couple hours. So we're going to ease it back one more time. The village is now in between these two blocks. And we got two more doors to place. And we will have this done, almost done. And then we'll have one more. So I'm going to walk through this all the way to the end here. And then you'll see what we do with the last one. And then I will give you guys another progress update. So that's been about six seconds. Let's move this and we'll go here bam there we go perfect wait your six seconds and then we will break the door two three four five six bam pick that up and bam there we go so now we've got the village all in a line. Now the reason we kicked this second one, this one right next to it back, is if this was still here, this village, once I break this door here, would merge with this one. And then it would all be one village in a row instead of 31 individual ones. And we don't want that. We want 30, we want 32 villages all in a row. So, bam, we got it. So now we have 31 villages in a row so i want to finish the last one we're going to make a progress update and i'll see you guys in a little bit and we are back and i kind of went a little ham bony yeah so i'm done with the titan we got our villagers over there we got our villagers in there and we got our villagers in there and i actually had a few of them drop out just a few and um yeah so we've got spawning golems look at this this is awesome so oh there we go there they go peace out homies goodbye oh let me get in there i don't want to die so yeah all right guys this is pretty awesome so we're uh, we're done we've got an iron titan so if you guys like this video please stomp that like button i would really appreciate it, it really helps me out and there goes another one peace out homie Bye. So if you guys like this, go ahead and stomp that like button. I really appreciate it. This took me a lot of hard work, but I think it's really going to help the Riot Craft crew out. I figure we get that going right away. First, well, second. E2, baby. Second episode, we've got an Iron Titan. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.